bird made it. Look at that. Look at that. That is amazing! Hey, good morning, everyone. Good morning! Wait, this is day two of Jerusalem. Mm -hmm. And I think we're gonna take a break from seeing the sights to do a little bit of uh, food tasting. Yeah, we're gonna try and find delicious food today. Yeah. Although, it is Shabbat. Yeah. Which is like a Jewish, uh, what do you call it? A religious day. Holy day. Holy day? And it's also two days before Hanukkah. Mm -hmm. It's like the last Shabbat before Hanukkah. And we've learned it's supposed to be a day where a lot of stores are closed, but a lot mm. of people are outside and it's bustling. Stores won't be closed until a few hours from now. Yeah. Um, they stay open for a little bit. It's a Friday. So we are going to go and attempt to get ourselves some delicious food before, oh, before everything closes down. Yeah. We expect the market to be a little wild. Yeah. Are we here? I think we're here. Yeah, this oh is it. God. that we're in Yehuda Market. Huge bazaar, huge market here in Jerusalem. It's a little further outside the uh, old city walls, but eh, it's totally worth it. This place is bumping, and there's so lots to eat and lots to buy. It's, it's gonna... like sensory overload, <laughs> yeah. which is our favorite. <laughs> so, and you can smell so many things too. So good. Right. So many wow. fresh falafels, so fun. I'm actually glad spices. we came here on like the busy day. Like yeah. I think today's like one of the busiest days and I thought that might be like kind of a bummer, but I actually think it's awesome. Yeah. Because it gets people just like mm -hmm. going around in their like regular, they're doing their normal life, right? Like they're grocery shopping and getting ready for the weekend, um, which is kind of cool. I think we spotted some bureka. Bureka. I want to give it a try. That was on our list of things we wanted to give it a try. And it's like a puff pastry with a bunch of different types of fillings. Comes in all different shapes and sizes. Yeah. Uh, I think we're gonna try the cheese one. And bureka, I understand, is a really typical um, part of Israeli cuisine or um, Jewish cuisine. So, let's try. Delicious flaky phyllo pastry stuff with cheese. He offered me the flat kind or like a triangle shaped one. I went for flat. Okay. I don't know what kind of cheese this is. Mm. It actually tastes fairly salty. Kind of like feta, not feta. Not the right texture, but kind of like feta. Um, and actually, this really reminds me of the pastizi that we had in Malta like two days ago or something. <laughs> Time is just flying, but this really is similar to the pastizi from Malta. Mm. I think this is traditionally eaten for like any time of day. I guess it's like a snack. It's 
Oh, cheese. <laughs> you get like the huge cheesy section? Mm. That's good. It's good, right? It would be good like breakfast, I think. Have this with like... Coffee. Coffee or... <laughs> tea. 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 This would be really good for breakfast. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. Mm. Let's find another food. Oh, those donuts. We gotta get those donuts for, um... <laughs> they're like Hanukkah donuts. Specialty right now because Hanukkah's coming up. We're calling them donuts. They're not called donuts. They've got a real name, mm -hmm. but they're very popular because Hanukkah's like in two days. And they look delicious. Oh, that's dangerous. Wow. That is so good. You don't need a dozen of these. That's for sure. Wow. That's incredible. I hope this is served year round. <laughs> Thank you. 
<laughs> so if you come to Jerusalem, you can't leave without trying the hummus. A little bit of hummus, hummus, some oil, made of chickpeas, very simple, and pita. That's really good. It's so soft. It's like a very, very, I don't know, it's like whipped cream, like uh, so soft, so good. Yeah, very soft. You can't see any really chunks of the chickpeas at all. This hummus was like drenched in extra olive oil before they gave it to us. This is the hummus number one in Israel. Thank <laughs> you, number one. Oh, that's good. Smooth, right? Mm, very smooth. And it tastes like simple, like really pure ingredients. I think it's just like lemon juice. I saw some water go in. And chickpeas. Maybe there's something else. Maybe tahini, but I don't know. Oh man, look at that. Something to be proud of, obviously. Mm. Perfect. I don't think we did this pita bread justice, so I had to I had to just show you one more time. Look at that. Look at that. That is amazing. Why is it so like stringy? <laughs> it's awesome. It's honestly so good. Well, we thought this place would close down at 2 o'clock. It's uh, 2.40 and this place is definitely not ready to shut. No. <laughs> there are still loads of people. And I think it's almost like the party is yeah. starting up. There are like, like a lot of bars, like a lot of bars a lot, in here. A lot of people already having drinks. And I mean, that started as soon as we got here. It really does feel like a, really does feel like a big party. It does. It's kind of neat. Yeah. It's hard. It's baklava. It's Oh, this is all baklava. It's all baklava. No, it's also it's snap. What do you want? I've never seen it like this. Thank you very much. Thank you so much. Grab some baklava. We've had baklava before in Turkey, um, but you know, Jerusalem has its own style. And look at this. It looks a little bit different than what we've had before. It looks so good. It doesn't look as drenched in like the kind of sugar water I've seen. But man, there's a lot to it. It's thick. Oh, and it smells delicious. Oh, it's crunchy. Wow. Mm. It's so sweet. It's just really crunchy, really sweet. Syrupy. God, I'm doing a bad job explaining this, but <laughs> it's delicious. It looks like a little nest. Like a bird made it. <laughs> How cute that, is that? That one looks really good. It looks Can you turn so, the top? It's so cute. Chocolate icing? I don't know. Oh my god. Well, that's amazing. It's thick. Like dense. Super sweet. So the top is quite like dry, and the bottom is what's really, really sugary. It's a really nice balance. Wow. Mm. 10 out of 10. Well, we uh, took a small break and... Yeah, we sat down for a few minutes and, and then, drew some shut down. And then all of a sudden, <laughs> yeah, everything is closed. Like, everything is closed. We're worried about, like, I don't even know what we're going to eat for dinner. I mean, it's a good thing we've been eating for the last, like, three yeah. hours. But I don't know what we're going to eat. <laughs> like, when we're hungry again in, like, eight hours? <laughs> I don't I know where we're going to get food. I don't know where we're going to get food ever. Anyways, yeah. that's probably a good thing because we pro we once again ate way too much food. Way too much. We're stuffed. <laughs> so I think we'll end the vlog there. Yes, we had another wonderful day. Tomorrow we've got another really big day of adventuring planned for the area, so we will see you then. All right, thanks for watching. Yes, great spot to drive, everybody. It's really interesting. I think I've never. I don't really know what. Like, it's going well. Yeah. I, uh, how do you say this? I didn't know what I was thinking. Oh, let me rephrase that. It's going well. Ooh.